welcome back to our Journeyman series with Fluminense. We're sitting in second one point behind Atletico Mineiro. Uh, if you didn't see the last episode, I thoroughly suggest you go out and uh, go back and watch that one because it was a drinking episode. It was a, a little bit of fun. Uh, but we're clear-headed and we're ready to get into another episode of the Journeyman. Uh, let's just do this. Right, so the transfer window is open. I'm going to see if there's any other players worth bringing in, but we've got four games for the month. Uh, I'll play the one at the end against Atletico because they are top of the table. We'll then move into August and, uh, well, the cup games are starting up. So uh, we'll have a crack at uh, probably the second leg. Hopefully we can score some goals in the first. Transfer offers are coming in hard and fast. Marin is not going anywhere. Reject all offers. Hoyos as well. Well, he's unhappy. I don't give a fuck. We are staying. Oh, Chelsea have come in with 95 million for Lombardi. Get fucked. Right, Barnsley came in and uh, 600 grand for Eldair, our right back. So he's been sold. Done. Monthly scouting update is back from Brazil. We've been there for five months now. Carlos Linz, still 83 to 94 after three months. So uh, could be something for the future for Brazil. Uh, Alessandro Brunco, 210 grand, six foot six. We'll sign him in and uh, the rest we'll leave for now. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It is a big game for you. It's Atletico Mineiro versus Fluminense. First versus second. They have two-point gap on us. So if we win here today, we could possibly be going top of the table. And uh, a big, big game here for Fluminense. They want bragging rights, that's for sure. And uh, not a lot of changes. Laukinen is now the starting right midfielder. And Leto, the Finnish right back, is now, now starting right back. He's only a 60-odd overall. It's uh, the lowest ranked player in the team. Hopefully he can do a job today. Probably one of the two front men will... I mean, Tuna through his Lombardi early. Takes his man on, Lombers. Cuts back nicely. Lombardi. Oh, what a save. There he is. <laughs> Three minutes. Fuck you. It's fucking Lombardi. 1-0 Fluminense. Three minutes is all it's taken. And big Lombers dominating the fucking Brazilian league. Ah, oh, destruction from the big Italian striker. Knocked the keeper over. Got the rebound, smashed it home, and that's the start Fabian Bush wanted for this team in a top of the table clash. How many goals has he scored? 11 goals so far for the season. You'd think he'd scored more, but uh, maybe he doesn't play every game. I don't know. We'll check the statistics at the end of the season. Oh, great work from Leto. Passes it off to Perella. Hatuna forward to Bocco. Bocco skips his man. He's done well. He's got Lombardi working with him, but it's all Bocco at the moment. Slips it across. Lombardi! Oh, just wide. And it's very up. It's the run out wide. It's Laukinen. Laukinen cuts back inside. Feeds it off. Very up. Works it. Oh, there's a fucking penalty if ever I've seen one. Ferry just ripped his fucking feet out from underneath him. And we're going to go to the spot. Well, it is a foul. Martin, he didn't really see oh, to Jesus. Get balance right there before making All the right, challenge. All right, Lombardi. Smash it home, son. Bang. 2-0. Fluminense taking the ascendancy here. Lombardi's got two. 27 minutes gone. Oh, Tommy Hatunen again with a big challenge. Ferrio whips this one off to Lombardi. He sees the run from Bocco. Here's Bocco. Cuts back nicely. He's going to slip it inside. Ferry up. Can't get on the end of it. Lombardi chases it down. Oh, he's trying to take out the goalkeeper. Ripped in deep. Come back out. Bocco's got it. Rips it in. Who's there? Oh, Ferry up. Is he called offside? I think he is. What a ball inside from Bocco. Ferry up whipped it past the keeper, but he was offside. A great ball into the box. Ferry had just caught out of place. Like Look at that ball. The Delicious the delivery. Half time, 2 0 Fluminense. Oh, great work from Leto. Perella. Sips it forward. Lombardi. Does well. Here's Leto. The right back gets forward. Leto. Oh, what a save. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Well, that was all too easy, wasn't it? Did you see how quickly he just slipped past our defenders? They couldn't lay a challenge. And they get one goal back. It's 2-1 now. 
That was all too bloody easy. For some reason, no one would get near enough for a challenge, and when they did, they completely missed it. Plus Hoyos, it's 2-1. Slips it forward. Here's Lombardi. Oh! Oh, he can't buy that hat-trick today. Back out, Eduardo. Gets the run from Marin. Slips it through. Lombardi. Oh, he couldn't control the shot. Not with missed the challenge. Here it comes. Feeds it off. Shot. It's gone wide. But Fluminense take the points. 2-1. And we should be top of the table. 13 shots to two. Outplayed. Absolutely outplayed. Even Leto, the young lad, a 7.4. Lombardi with a 9. Great effort from the boys. Healthy scouting update from Canada. Is there any... Oh, here we go. Eric Kerr. We scouted him for two months. 110. Still 94 potential. We'll sign him in. And uh, Reese Moore, he's got a low overall. He's worth 70 grand. We'll keep an eye on him. Tremblay, a low overall as well. Only 40 grand. And Dennis Harbour, another. That overall is really going to hurt these lads trying to get a name for themselves in a team. All right, Finland, what have you got for us? Uh, Koskinen, we've scouted him for two months. 110 grand, only 15. We'll keep him there for now. And uh, Pavlo, Pavola, Emil Pavola, 60 grand. Koskinen, 120. Could be okay, but he is 17. We'll give him another month to mature there. Uh, Katunin looks pretty decent. 80. We'll uh, watch him a bit longer. Uh, Tomoe. Okay, he looks pretty good at 15. We'll keep an eye on him. Ooh, Tavonen looks pretty good. 250. Get him in. Six foot six. Yes. All right. All right. There's another Finland man into the squad. All right. Let's have a look at this youth academy. Miguel Cruz, 86 to 92. Koskinen is a 90 to 94. Eduardo Rossi, 87 to 94. 61 overall. And uh, I feel he probably needs to come into the team. So we'll offer him a contract. Uh, the young Brazilian right midfielder. Uh, Eric Kerr, 77 to 94. Rantanen, 86 to 92. A low overall, though. Uh, Castaneda, 88 to 94. Rivera, 83 to 89. Pyongping, 80 to 86. He is going to be released. Uh, Branco, 81 to 94. Pedro Jesus, 84 to 94. Antti Carilia, 79 to 89. I'm only keeping him in because he's from Finland. Uh, Tavonen, 79 to 94. The right back we've just signed up. Six foot six, 59 overall. And uh, we'll give him another month, but he might come in as well. Dewey Tian, 78 to 92. And that is our full squad. He's 18. He's probably going to want a contract shortly. All right, results for July. A 4-0 win against America. 2-1 loss against Paranense, or however you say it. Sao Paulo, we won 4-0. And then the 2-1 win against Atletico. We move into August. And uh, I'm going to play the second leg of the Copa Brasileira against Santos. Got an offer for Chandong Park. I'm not even sure he's had a game. Uh, he's okay, but he's unhappy with the amount of game time he's been getting. And if Figurense won him for 2.2 million, I'm going to reject all offers. Well, the big news is that Lombardi's torn his calf muscle and will be without him for eight weeks. That could really play a part for our season. All right, we'll just do a live sim here on the first leg of the Copa Brasileira against Santos. And our park is going to start up front. Lombardi out for eight weeks, so our firepower is gone. And Santos take the lead 1-0. The Silviera missed a penalty. I'm not sure why he was taking it. Uh, Eduardo comes on for Castinha. Come on, boys. Give us a goal. We're 2-0 down now. And, oh. De Silviera gets the penalty. We get one back. Come on. We want some level peggings here. Come on, boys. Fight for it. We're 2-1 down going into the second leg. All right. I need another striker to come into the team. So it's Daniel Rios Lozano, a Spanish striker at 70 overall, uh, just to help us out because it uh, could be a real struggle for eight weeks. So uh, we'll get some backup in. And the scout is back once again from Brazil. Uh, and a few of the lads have been cleaned out here. Carlos Linz is still 88 to 94. I'm going to sign him in. Um, but let's have a look at what else we've got here. Uh, Concial, 60 grand. We'll keep an eye on him. And, uh, ooh, 50 to 68, 69, 93. Goalkeeper, sign him in. All right, Brazil. All right, we've got a big transfer offer here for Marlon Santos. I don't want to get rid of him because uh, the team could fall apart without the 81 centre-back. I'm going to reject all offers. Bugger him. He's still under contract. Hopefully the board doesn't sell him. But right, we have sold Val Picos off to Aston Villa for 2.1 million. He was a 73 overall centre-back. All right, Copa Brasileira time. Uh, it's the second leg. We're 2-1 down on aggregate. We don't have Lombardi. 
And uh, we're going to have to turn things around here. We've got the one away goal, so uh, a 1 0 victory should see us through, but I don't want to leave it to chance. Let's see if we can find some goals. And can Chang Dong Park get himself a goal? To Finland. Laukinen works the keeper. Oh, where was Lombardi? Laukinen. Very up. Slips it forward. Tommy Hutunen! Oh, get in! Park! Park it! Fucking get in! Hutunen with an absolute smash from outside the box. It ricochets back. Look at this strike from Hutunen. He just took it off a step. Bang! And Park was there to pick it up. Fuck a spring roll. He's done well. And young Korean has done very, very well. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Chang Dong Park. Park the Dong. 1-0 on the day and 2 all on aggregate. Oh, he's got some pace, the young lad. Cuts inside nicely. Picked off. Laukinen, what was that shot, mate? He hit it like it was a potato. Off to Tommy Hatunen. Slips it forward. Park's made the run for him. Here's Park. Save. Walk off. Oh. Oh, Perella's picked him off nicely. There's Perella. Oh, that's a ball through. Ferrier gets in. 2 0 Fluminense. 3-2 on aggregates. We take the lead. And Ferrier, the Brazilian cam, has absolutely made a break. Look at that. That's a cracking line to be running. A little touch. And what a fucking wonder strike that is. Lombardi will be watching from the stands. Happy that the lads are fighting for him. And we take the lead. 2-0 on the day, 3-2 on aggregate. Fabian Bush has done it again. Oh, it could be dangerous. Are you serious? Where was the fucking free kick for Karelia being absolutely molested? Oh, no. Well, it's all tied up at 3-3. Karelia, what the hell just happened there? He's got the ball. Oh, fuck me. How's that not a free kick? Don't need a dick, ref. Open your fucking eyes. Half time, it's 3 3 on aggregate, and now we have some work to do. Well, that's a great ball down the line. He's unleashed the dong. Oh, send him off. What a fucking disgusting challenge. Send him red. Give him the red. Ah, oh, just a yellow. Soft ref. All right, come on. Can we fucking do something here? Laukinen whips it inside. Boko. Straight at the keeper. Morella. Park. Changdong Park, he's got pace, cuts back nicely, Changdong Park, oh big dongers, get in young son, get in, we take the lead, 4-3 on aggregate, it's Changdong Park really making a name for himself here today, Lombardi is out, we're looking for someone to stand tall, and big dongers done it, yes, get in son, alright it's going to be Marin, he's just come on, Sets it up into the box. Perella trying to go. Oh, where's the penalty? Here's Lozano. The young lads just come on. Oh, super substitution from Fabian Bush. Lozano signed a contract only a few days ago. And there he is making a name for himself immediately. An impact player. The striker comes on. We put him in the left midfield because they didn't want to take the dong off. And he fucking gets himself a goal. We're through. Great finish. There's Lozano. Oh, Ferrier. Slips on through. Oh, Ferrier keeps going. Oh, he's got a shot here. Oh, it was poor, but we've got a corner. Fluminense coming up big now. And it's going to be Park to whip it in. He's going to get another crack at the cherry here, Park. Takes it around. Oh, what's he done? He's run out of juice. And there it is. We've done it. What a comeback. What a story. Shangdong Park has absolutely blitzed it. And then we go through to the next round. Well, oh, Fluminense dominated that one. And Shangdong Park's had an absolute game. But Perella, a 9.6. All right, so players leaving on international duty. Hatunen, Leto, Lakut, Laukinen, Karelia, and Arno Jimmy have all been picked in the Finland side. By us, of course. So five of our players here from Fluminense. All right, it's transfer deadline day. A couple more signings. Jonathan Roncaglia, uh, Argentinian centre midfielder, 69 overall. Just trying to build some squad depth here now. 
uh, while the young players make their way in. And Branislav Dimov, I believe he's a Russian centre-back, 70 overall. All right, let's have a look at the August results. A 2-1 win against Cortiba and then a 3-0 win against Cruzeiro. Then Lombardi got injured. We lost 2-1 to Santos in the first leg. We lost 2-0 to Grêmio. We came back and won 4-1 against Santos. Uh, and then a 1-0 win against Sport and a 2-1 win against Atletico. Uh, we'll be moving into September next. We have some World Cup action against Scotland and Sweden. All right, let's do a player upgrade uh, for this one. We're going to upgrade Leto. He's the starting right back now, the finish right back, and had a pretty good game. So uh, let me know in the comments if you'd like to make any changes to his kit or number, and we'll make that happen in a future episode. All right, so it doesn't look like we're going to qualify for the World Cup uh, games. So I want you to let me know in the comments down below, do you want me to continue to play this World Cup qualifiers, or should we push through until the next World Cup and get this... Uh, career mode really motoring on. Uh, so let me know in the comments and uh, I'll make a decision on whether I'm going to play them or not. Uh, but yeah, your input will be valued. Alright, taking a look at some of the other leagues. Well, the Australian League isn't playing at the moment, so uh, well, that was worth checking out. In Japan, Gamba Osaka are top of the table, so uh, the young lads must be starting to uh, get a decent rating about them and, and a nice resurgence there from Gamba Osaka. And in the MLS, well, it's Toronto level with New York Red Bull. As for Fluminense, we are top of the table at currently by six points. So uh, things are looking good for us completing stage four. If we can keep this up, get Lombardi back, we should have a big charge uh, moving forward. 42 goals for. That is ridiculous. Uh, but that's where we're going to leave it today. Hopefully you've enjoyed the episode. We'll see you in the next one. I'm Spine DK. It's five o'clock somewhere. And you, have a good one.